I'm Dr. Melissa Hill, and I'm one of the chemistry staff scientists here at Vernier and our resident spectroscopist. Vernier offers a few different types of spectrophotometers, absorbance, fluorescence, emission, and flash photolysis. Our GoDirect spectrometers are supported by our free spectral analysis app, which walks your students through the data collection process and includes analysis features such as curve fitting and data interpolation. Today I'm here to talk to you about a common question that our customers have, which is, what is the difference between all of these spectrometers? In essence, which spectrometer is right for me? Visible spectroscopy occurs between 380 and 900 nanometers. Several samples that you could look at in the visible spectrum are food coloring, nickel sulfate, crystal violet, really anything that's a color of the rainbow. So if you're instructing high school, AP, or introductory level college chemistry and biology, chances are you want a visible spectrophotometer. Our two visible spectrophotometers include the GoDirect SpectraVis Plus and the GoDirect Visible Spectrophotometer. The GoDirect SpectraVis Plus Spectrophotometer is an affordable way to introduce your students to spectroscopy. It has a broader specification range for wavelength accuracy, photometric accuracy, and reproducibility. Plus, it has fluorescence capabilities at 405 and 500 nanometers. A fiber optic cable can be purchased separately to allow emissions measurements. The GoDirect Visible Spectrophotometer is our second visible spectrophotometer, and it has a narrower specification range for wavelength accuracy, reproducibility, and photometric accuracy. Also, if you want to do emissions, you can detach the light source from the Vernier spectrometer and use a fiber optic cable to measure emissions from a gas discharge tube or a flame test. We have two options for UV-Vis absorbance spectroscopy. The first is the GoDirect UV-Vis spectrophotometer. The wavelength range of this spectrometer is 220 to 850 nanometers. This increased UV range, accuracy, and precision make it ideal for higher level applications such as college chemistry classes like organic chemistry, biochemistry, molecular biology, and student research projects. The GoDirect Fluorescence UV-Vis spectrophotometer is our second option for UV-Vis spectrophotometers, but this one also measures fluorescence. The wavelength range of this spectrometer is also 220 to 850 nanometers, and it can measure absorbance and fluorescence back to back in the same instrument of a diverse array of samples, including vitamins, fluorescein, and fluorescent proteins. These LED cartridges act as the excitation sources, allowing for a variety of excitation wavelengths. For both of these options, you can use a separate fiber optic cable placed in the cuvette holder to measure emissions from gas discharge tubes such as hydrogen. The GoDirect emissions spectrometer is designed specifically for students to examine emission spectra. The wavelength range of this spectrometer is 350 to 950 nanometers. The fiber optic is sold separately. The Vernier flash photolysis spectrometer is specifically designed for demonstrating the fundamental principles of chemical kinetics and photochemistry. The wavelength range of this spectrometer is 450 to 750 nanometers, and it's important to note that this spectrometer is currently for Windows only and works through USB. We provide the flash photolysis spectrometer software as a free download. With the exception of the flash photolysis spectrometer, it's important to remember that all of our spectrometers can collect full spectrum data in addition to time-based data or event-based data. So Beer's Law and Kinetics experiments are no trouble at all. You can see the full specification list for all of these spectrometers on our website. If you have any additional questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at chemistry at vernier.com.